Look at him climb. Hi everybody, today we're back at the Greater Vancouver Zoo. Let's go and explore and see what animals we encounter. These adorable bear cubs are triplets found by Alberta Fish and Wildlife officers in Crow's Nest Pass after their mother was killed by hunters. They were relocated to the zoo in July 2020 after the Calgary Zoo ran out of room for the cubs. The male cub was given the name Henry in honor of the provincial health officer Bonnie Henry. The females are named Huggy Bear and Scout. The Greater Vancouver Zoo has fairly wide open and expansive habitats for the animals, so you may not be able to always see them up close. Off at the back of the pen is Zara, a 15-year-old female northern lynx. It's pretty chilly out, but these lynx are well adapted, growing a thick coat for the winter months. They have excellent eyesight and hearing and can easily detect camouflage hairs on the winter snow. Here's a Muscovy duck. At the zoo, they have two sisters, Dixie and Dizzy, both eight years old. Muscovy ducks are typically found in forested wetlands and range from northern Mexico down to Argentina. These are large ducks and have a wingspan that can reach up to 154 centimeters across. But despite this, they're one of the oldest domesticated fowl species in the world. This is a female collared peccary whose name is Green Bean and is 12 years old. Collared peccaries are found in the tropical rainforests of South and Central America. <laughs> oh, is that what he hears? And in the Cigarro Deserts in the United States. Ah, it's meal time. Collared peccaries enjoy a variety of food, including root bulbs, <laughs> fungi, nuts, fruits, eggs, even snakes, fish, and frogs. Oh boy. Collared peccaries are also commonly known as javelinas because of their javelin-like tusks. This red fox is really active today. There are two red foxes at the Greater Vancouver Zoo. There's a six-year-old female named Holly and a six-year-old male named Mayhem. Red foxes are found throughout the world in forests, grassland, and deserts. They have the largest range of any land carnivore and are found in every Canadian province as well as the US, Europe, Asia, North Africa and Australia. Despite the name, red foxes actually come in a variety of colors from red-orange to brown, black and even silver. And we're lucky the red panda is out today too. This is a seven-year-old male named Aaron. Red pandas are native to the southwestern China and eastern Himalayas. They're found in temperate forests, typically in mild climates of high altitude. About 98% of the red panda's diet consists of bamboo, and the other 2% is a variety of small bird eggs, insects and small mammals. Even though red pandas share the same name as the giant panda, they're actually not related. Instead, the red pandas are closer in relation to skunks and raccoons. 
Unfortunately, these beautiful creatures are officially on the endangered list because their habitat is being encroached upon by humans. It's putting on a climbing show. Dromedary camels originate from Asia and North Africa and graze on grasses, leaves, and shrubs. At the Greater Vancouver Zoo, there are two of them, a 31-year-old male named Nimit and a female 18-year-old named April. Dromedary camels have a life expectancy of up to 50 years. They also munch on thorny desert plants, keeping their mouths open and chewing each bite between 40 and 50 times. Unfortunately, these Peridavids deer are officially extinct in the wild. At the zoo is a 17-year-old female deer named Zia, who shares an enclosure with a herd of Sika deer. Skeptical of me. The Greater Vancouver Zoo also has a herd of scimitar horned orcs. It's an all-female herd consisting of Onyx, Asha, Olive, Olia, Octavia, and Ophelia, all ranging in age from 2 years old to 11 years old. Although the scimitar orcs were once prevalent through the deserts of northern Africa, unfortunately today they're extinct in the wild. So we had a couple good encounters there, animals that we haven't seen that lively before. I guess it just depends on the time of day and the weather. Hope you enjoyed our trip. Remember to take care and travel safe. And until next time, it's time to exit through the gift shop.